Hey guys, this will be a tutorial on how to put ROMs from your computer to your Android phone. What you do is you unlock your phone. Oh god, you saw my path code. Y'all are gonna come find me and hack me. Oh no. And then, well, I need to unhook it and hook it back up. So I can pull up the autoplay menu. Alright, I did that, and you'll see this screen. USB connected. Connect USB storage. And you'll see this screen, just click OK. And once that screen is over and done with, you'll see that. USB storage in use in the Android Gal term orange. Now just give it a second. There it is. You see, I need to put this back up so I can see if I'm doing it. <laughs> Sorry. But yeah, you'll see um, the removable disk thing. You click open folder to view files. And you have all your files here, your core files. And I already made a folder for YouTube. And I already just clicked and dragged one of my ROMs in here. And I did Tetris, but I'll just move Pokemon Gold in there just for just for tutorial's sake. Alright, now that should copy. There it is. And you exit out of your ROMs folder and you exit out of the removal disk and you go back to your phone. You unlock it. And you'll still see the USB storage in use. Once you're done doing all that, you click stop. And USB connected, disconnected, blah, 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 blah. Alright. After you do that, you go to the emulator of your choice, which mine is GBA, not GBA, I'm um, GBCAD, but I already have a game running. So, and I'm going to show you all the game that I actually did, so you'll see working proof. Oh, crap. Um, task manager... Exit. Alright. Go to my applications. Use GBCAD. And you see I've got Pokemon Gold here. Well, I... Crap, I clicked Tetris. But you get the point. <laughs> you understand that it works. And there you have it. That is how you... Do all that. That's how you move your computer ROMs to your Android phone. See you guys